Hello friends, Dapper Driver here. Welcome back to another box opening. Today we have a Battle Styles booster box. That's right. 36 wonderful packs. Choosing our battle style wisely. I mean, are we rapid? Are we are we uh, single strike? You never know. You never know. But we have a full box here to open up and see what we pull out. I'm looking for some good stuff. I have gotten a lot of the good stuff already in other openings that, are, that I had not done on this channel. I've got them through... Uh, a uh, third-party service, I guess. Um, but you know what? Let's go ahead and get started at this, and uh, let's see what we get in this today. Thirty seconds. So you know that that's that's all people need to get started into, <laughs> into videos, right? All right. So we got be a titan, full of power or strike with impossible speed. It it all depends on your martial um yeah martial stat mastery. Uh, channel the power of Pokemon V like Mimikyu, Tyranitar, Empoleon, and more. You'll also find a handful of impressive V-Maxes, including Gigantamax, Urshifu, in both single and rapid strike styles. Unleash epic ma uh, smash-ups with the Pokemon Sword and Shield Battle Style Expansion. So yes, the newest set. I am still, this is still getting everywhere. Dandruff Galore. I feel like I need to wash my hands like after this because it's like, it's just on me. It's just on me. Oh, let's see. Let's see. There we go. Got a clean break. Got a clean break. Wow, yeah. Throw that away and get rid of this white stuff everywhere. I don't want that on my cards or anything. <laughs> Jesus. It's just everywhere. It's just everywhere awesome awesome so anybody got any hot pulls that they want to call out in chat or in the comment section below what do we think we're gonna get what's what's the big card and how many packs do you guys think it's gonna be down boom there we go the big two stacks pretty cool booster box has rapid strike here single strike here Empoleon and Titar all the faves all the faves um, let me grab some penny sleeves here because that's what I have near me. As I can still keep it caught. There we go. I don't know if I have any empty top loaders around. I think I used all those. But we'll throw the penny sleeves up there and we'll get started. Let's see the arts we have. For the packs, we have Empoleon art. We have a Rapid Strike Urshifu art, Single Strike Urshifu art, and a Tyranitar art. So yeah, all the big four. The big four. The two big Single Strikers, the two big Rapid Strikers. And let's see. First pack. Let's see if it's some magic. Um, oh, there is one thing I forgot. It was like a set-aside spot for, uh, for codes and whatnot. I feel like I'm going to do it behind my camera so you guys can not be spoiled. All right. Pack trick done. Throw those over there. We got a water energy to start things off with. A Houndor, Lickitung, Horsey, a Mankey, a Mawile, Gliscor, Bruno, Rapid Strike Style, Mustard, and a Houndoom Reverse, followed by a Drampa Regular Rare. Oof. Alright, so I guess we should do Rare, Reverse. I want to say uncommon, but it's like trainers, commons. Since these are my cards, that's that's probably the way they're gonna be uh, separated after the fact. So it's it's fine doing it that way now. All right, one, two, three. Let's guess the energy is fighting because it's a fighting box, right? It's a dark. I don't know if you guys could actually see that. Dark though. We got Spoink. Um, yeah, that is uh, common. Galarian, Mr. Mime. Scatterbug. Ball. <laughs> ball Search Yamper. Lickitung. A Cacturn. Level Ball. Those are nice to get back. Single Strike Energy. Reverse is a Corefish. And a Hollow Houndoom. It's a nice little first hit. Houndoom, Houndoom. Wow. Stack Maintenance is already like. Am I doing this right? <laughs> but I hope everyone's doing well today. Um, 
Like I said, I'm not definite what day I'm getting this out onto YouTube, but we are filming it on Wednesday over on twitch.tv backslash Dapper Drabby. So if you guys do feel like checking out openings, I tend to do them on Wednesdays if I can. Um, sometimes I end up just doing deck building or something with like Digimon. Uh, I've also been looking into doing some um, PTCGO. Anakon Kelder. So it's a little bit up in the air, but it's usually dedicated towards card games on Wednesdays. So if you guys are interested in card games, feel free to come by and check it out. Um, I know I do hope to eventually grow into doing breaks. However, I don't have enough uh, enough background. Um, well, not background. I know how to do it. I don't have enough uh, product to have a, a store at this point. We got Ball Toy, Timbers, Corefish, Cacnea, Mawile, Grump Pig, Energy Recycler, Girder, Tower of Waters, and our first hit is an Empoleon V. Emperor's Eyes. As long as this Pokemon is in the active spot, your opponent's basic Pokemon in play have no abilities except for Pokemon with a rule box. What does that stop? These guys? stops Houndoom Octillery it doesn't stop V cards is, is that is that what I'm hearing correctly or am I hearing that correctly so let me show them a little bit better here it stops Jirachi yeah oh it only stops basics too yeah that that, that is a bit of a feels bad isn't it one two three energy I mean, it does stop both, both Jirachis at least. We got a Gligor, Salandit, Bronzor, Cacnea, Spoink, a Phoebe, Carnivine, Fero, Sanda, Conda, Don't Want None, and a Phalanx. I do like Sanda Conda. I want to build it, um, so maybe I'll pull enough to get to build it today, but we'll see. You thought it was a Decidueye counter, and it, it's just not. Yeah, that that sucks. It'd be nice if there was a Decidueye counter. Fire energy. We got ourselves a Shinx, Flipbug, Ponyard, a Mankey, Silizipede, a Rapid Scroll Strikes, Swir stroll, Scroll of the Swirls, I don't know, Boofalant, a Crawdont. Reverse is an Aegislash. That's a rare. And oh, we got the rainbow. Single strike. Urshifu VMAX. Rainbow. There's the big hit. Big hit right there. Urshifu VMAX. Rainbow. Our pride. That's what I've been calling them lately. It's the, it's the pride cards. That seems pretty well centered and stuff too. Um, what do you guys think? Slightly thicker on the bottom, maybe? I know, my glare doesn't doesn't help at all. Uh, I would throw that in a top loader, but I don't think I have an empty one near me. They all have something in them. Why do I have a Pikachu V in one? That's kind of messed up. I don't know if Pikachu V belongs in one, but... All right, I guess all we can hope for now is like an alt art, right? But I feel like it's one of the one thing per thing. I'm gonna go ahead and give out this code. I tend not to give out codes, but I don't know. This is a bigger video, so I'll give out a few every so often. It's not gonna be after certain packs. I'm just gonna say, yeah, sure, <laughs> yeah, sure. We got a Psychic Energy, a Murkrow, Tepig, a Hone Edge with the Ambush, Haymaker, love that this attack is called Haymaker, <laughs> and it does like almost the same thing, 30 damage, still 25 years later, Ball Toy, we got Golbat, Gliscor, Indeedy, Reverse is a Crawdont, and a Corviknight VMAX, wow, back to back hits. Looks like I can still play my Luke Mel that I never played in the first place. 
Yeah, love that Electabuzz's attack is is, uh, is what it is. I was like, oh, that's hilarious. Now, if only they had a Hitmonchan, that also was going at Haymaker. 30 damage and can't use it next turn. That actually wouldn't have been bad. They could have actually made those single and rapid strikers too. We got Slowpoke. Corefish, Ace of Landit, Roly Colioli, Esper, Dotler, a Dewblade with the cut down, Pe Pig Knight, Pigging Out. Cherum, that's a nice reverse rare to hit. That's a good ability one. And a Drampa. Why do we already got two Drampas though? I don't I don't call my family that often. Or sometimes not at all. No, never, you know. I'm gonna be accused of like sneakily pulling the code out of the frame. <laughs> Yamper, ball search. Hey, Glamia, Core Fish, Scatterbug, Cubon Bum Bum, Cubon Bone, Durant, a Perugly, Tool Jammer. We got Lorantis and a rare Marowak. Actually got quite a few reverse rares so far. Wow, with only like halfway through the top here, it's it's like already like too many packs there. Too many commons. One, two, and a three. Let's get some water energy since we just got one. Oh, it goes water dark. Cherubi, a Lickitung, Electabuzz with the Haymaker, Focus Wish, Esper, a Timber, Girder. What an evolution. Seedra, fan of the ways of Rapid Strike. We got a Gliger, it does 30 damage. Um, common, reverse, and Electivire. Tumbling attack. Lightning Slam. Don't know if Lightning Slam's ever going to be announced. Like, there is, like, a way to get four Lightning Energies on a Stage 1. But it's it's not likely going to to stay there, or it'll be knocked out before it gets a chance to attack. All right, let's see what else are we get in there. A grass energy, Yamper Ball Search, Murkrow, Salandit, Bell Sprout, Double Stab, Mind Foo, a Level Ball, Single Strike Energy, Jumping Kick, Luxio. The Urn of Vitality. Kind of want that. Put those single strike energies back. And our rare is a Hollow Meow Stick. Your moves. During your turn, you may move one damage counter from one of your Pokemon to one of your opponent's Pokemon. Oh, so is that stackable then? I thought it had to be active to do that. But I guess not. Yeah, that seems decent. That seems like a decent hollow ability. Cause you can do that, you can move four per turn. That might be good. Isn't there uh, attacks that do more damage based off of the amount of damage on your opponent too? Like uh, Sableye or something? So that could be a good combo. A grass, grass energy, okay. Electabuzz, Bellsprout. A Bronzor, Murkrow. Horsey, love this artwork. It's like a perfect little semi round. We got Golbat, Energy Recycler. That's actually good to get back to. Urn of Vitality. We got a Phoebe Reverse and a Urshifu Rapid Striker. Urshifu Rapid Strike B. So far, this this uh this um. <laughs> This box a little all over the place. It's it's not made a decision of, 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 of what it's doing just yet, so it's been fun to try to figure that out. It's got singles, it's got rapids. Lightning energy. I mean I guess it's more rapid at this point. Chai Mecho, and Onyx, Salizapede, Glamiao, Galarian Poke, Energy Recycler, Girder, Cacturn, Reverse is a Mindfoo. Double step with Cherum Hollow. That's nice to see like two of these because like that means I can already like kind of build with it. I didn't say build well. <laughs> I can build with it, but I can't necessarily build well with it yet. I'm putting these right in a glare, ain't I? Aren't I? Yep. The super glare, but I mean the, the Cherum really pops. This is 
I should learn this so when I next time I play Pokemon Pictionary, my my Cherim doesn't look like a, a green flower, like it like it did last time I played. I, I just made it look like a green flower, and people are like that's not Cherim. I'm like, oh yeah, the the card is green, not the uh, not the actual, not the actual Pokemon. Oh, we got a Fighting Energy, Frillish, Houndor, Scatterbug, Hone Edge, Gligar. Carnivine, Sword and Shieldbert, B Sharp, Bruxish. I don't know why they keep printing this card as like a bad card. It's literally a filler card. Unhinged Hammer. I didn't know Slow Slow Bro could do an unhinged hammer, but that sounds like a fun attack. I didn't know a hammer had a hinge, but it does sound like a fun attack. If if I gotta be honest, it's it's a fun attack. Oh yeah, I guess I should announce that I, um, if I end up doing more PTCGO, um, I'll probably do some viewer battles and stuff, and I do tend to give away, like, some stuff on PTCGO, um, I don't know if I'll get back into deck profiles and stuff, just because I've not been focusing on the game as much lately, I've been focusing more on, like, Digimon lately, which I'm not sure about doing deck p profiles for that either, but I have been entering some events, I have some, some playing, um, some play recorded, but I haven't done much else with it. Galarian, Mr. Rhyme, there he is, the ball juggler himself. You get Pokeball, Great Ball in your hand. You throw it at your opponent for 90 damage. You play Yamper and get it right back next turn. So that's a fun card. I'm trying to think which card, like, memed me the most. And, um,. My giant PTCG opening. I know, but I did see like three rainbow Phoebes, which was kind of ridiculous. We got a Psychic Energy. Parniard. Timber. Tepix. Glam Meow. Stilly Cobra. A hey, Phoebe. Haunchcrow. Insomnia. That's an interesting one. Too bad, like, your ability is not transferable in this game. Fomantis and Mirrorwack. That'd be kind of fun if you could, like, transfer an ability to another one of your your Pokemon on the bench or something like that. I wonder if they would ever make, like, an item card or something that does that. Like, if you attach this, you can copy you and your one of the abilities of your other Pokemon. Or would that be too broken? That might be too broken. I still have some of that white danger stuff on my hands. Hey, uh, Metal Energy. Mine foot. Ball Toy, Galarian Mr. Mime, A Fomantis, Sparrow, Dooblade, Pig Knight, Piggin' Out, Scroll of the Squir Swirls, that's a tongue twister, Chimeco, and an Octillery Hollow. Now we got both sides. This is like an even down the middle box. That would be nuts, right? Like copy, copy one of the other abilities you have on, on board. Give it a Sentinel supporter lock to sell. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I mean, may maybe they'll do something with the rule box things, right? Who knows? <laughs> Pokemon with dual box cannot take this ability from you. Water energy. That would be a pretty nuts card. I want to see it, like, made just so they can ban it. <laughs> like, legitimately. <laughs> The Sharp, Weeping Bell, Boofalot, and a Mr. M Rhyme. <laughs> if I get one more, I can probably play this deck, right? Not that you ever wish to get Mr. Rhymes. Right, I'm going to go ahead and put the commons away here. Probably put the uncommons over here too. That's so true. You can get around rule box shenanigans. Let's go ahead and give away another code. You're playing like a, a bouncy card over here with the, the packs. to get some spring to them. Let's see a psychic energy. Blip bug. A Pawniard. A Mankey. A Salizapede. Ball toy. Self-destructing. 
Does 60 damage to itself? That's fun. Seedra. Weeping Bell. XP Share. Rapid Strike Artillery. And a Cricketune. I feel like I've gotten a lot of rares in reverse slots today so far. And what's our, our high end up here? We have two, we have a VMAX, we have a rainbow, and three Vs so far. Let's do it this way. High end, low end, hollows. That didn't work out. Okay, let's see. We got a metal energy. Bell sprout. Mean foo. Yamper searching for those Pokeballs. Glamio. Crawfish. Heat more is an uncommon. Okay. Furo. Escape a rope. That's good to have back. Pig Knight and a Licky Licky. Now, the fact that its attack is select, I, I'm just like, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Why does it need an attack called select? You gotta select whether your opponent selects whether you discard the top three of their deck or discard three cards from their hand. Yeah, Yamper has to, like, it doesn't make sense to me that it's Pokeball, Great Ball. It's like, it forces your hand, so you have to play those. It would have been awesome to be able to, like, grab Quick Balls, Level Balls, everything. And I mean, two is balanced, I feel. But I guess they felt like Pokeball and Great Ball are weak enough where they're not going to promote the board state. But, like, already my favorite thing to do is, like, scoop up Netta Yamper and get, like, Pokeball, Great Ball, Pokeball, Great Ball, and just like play around with that. Overheater, when your opponent flips a coin for their burn during the Pokemon checkup, it doesn't recover from that special, that status condition. That's a long-winded way to say you can't get rid of burn. <laughs> Very long-winded way to say you cannot get over burn. I mean, I do still feel like Yamper's the next uh, big scoop up net target. One, two, three. Energy. We got a water energy. Cat kick Lammy out. Didn't the Per Ugly get um Catterday? Yeah, it did. Per Ugly has Catterday, so there's like a new Catterday in this set as well. Camper! Scout and Murkrow, Ace Landit, Cheryl. Rapid Strike Energy. Phoebe. That is a good trainer pack. Ponyard and a Tapu Koko V Max. Wow, I feel like we hit all our top end before we hit any of our low end. It was like in the middle of that second stack. And then like the top of the... Or I mean it was the middle of the first stack and like top of the second stack. I mean to be honest, the wording on a lot of cards are weird. And no matter what TCG you're playing. You're just like, why did they word it that way? Somebody's been writing too many contracts or something. Grass Energy, Lick a Tongue, Electa Buzz, Focus the Wish, Esper, The Timber, Galarian Poke, and Indeed. Crawdot, Tower of Waters, Reverses of V-Sharp, and a Rare. Primate, Steaming Mad Strike. He's steaming. He's mad. He's striking. Man, some of these packs are sticking like crazy. One, two, and a three. That would be an energy. Electric. Ooh, wah, ooh, wah, electric. Hey, blip bug. Roly coly oly. Shy Mecker Miner. Aaron running. Search your deck for two basic energy cards to reveal them and put them into your hand. And then get them more need away. Onyx. Uh, Salizapede. Uh, Rapid Strike. Mustard. More Pico. Hangry Tackle. We're gonna build that deck too. Hangry tackling. Experience share and a Tapu Babulu. Bababulu. 
Nature's Judgment. Why does this seem like a reprint? This really seems like a reprint. I thought they had Nature's Judgment. I guess it was on the the Tapu Bulu GX, so they're just like, we're just gonna make it the same attack, but weaker. That's hollow worthy, right? That's like a hollow. I, I think that's a hollow. I don't know. Alright, let's open up another pack. Do 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 Energy is fighting. Just some big fight guys in this. Bellsprout, Bronzor, Murkaro, Horsey, Chove Ruby, The Big Pig Knight, Fan of Waves, Dotler, Marowak, and a Kulalator. Attach Psychic Energy to your discard power for your Pokemon any way you like for your until your Pokemon or your opponent's Pokemon have the same total amount of energy attached. I'm confused on like what that number would be. Sounds like a super strong effect, especially for a colorless. But it is specifically psychic. And like, is it based off of like the active, the bench, like... I don't know, I'll have to play that one on PTCGO and see how they roll it to figure out my own ruling on it. I think that's what I'll have to do. Fair energy. It's gonna be dark. Ah, it's fire. I need to stop guessing the energy. I am not good at that game. Sparrow! Hey, Zubat. Cubone, Bone, Bone, Cubone, Bone, Frillish. Spoopa. Gliscor. Boruno. Cacturn. With a Lorantis. I don't know if Lorantis has been good since Lorantis GX, to be honest. I feel like they always make him, like, slightly weak. Oh, no, I think the best the best Lorantis was the, twi the add 20 damage one. That promo, you could not find it in the wild. It was that good. And then when it, uh... And then when it, uh, rotated, it just never... You never saw it again. <laughs> Houndor, Scatterbag, Hone Edge, Gligar, Electabuzz, Golbat, Bruno, Karkle, Imbor, Single Striker, uh, Fighting Fury Stance. Um, your Single Strike Pokemon do 30 more damage to your opponent's active. Isn't it easier just to play... What was it, Incineroar? I guess what, um... The combo with Imbor is with, uh... Single strike mustard. The mustards work like um, Archie and what's his name, right? Yeah, the mustards work like um, Maxi and Archie. So you use this for, because this is a single strike mon. You use um, single strike mustard to get it out, and then um, out of your discard pile, and then you draw five cards. That's how that one works. They were impossible to find. We had one guy that had four and loaned them to everybody <laughs> who wanted to play it. Yeah, I think I had the Zoroark Galissapod deck with it for a hot sec. Oh, one of the mustards gets from the deck. That's way better. Well, let's read them, I guess. We have both of them in here, I'm sure. Rapid Strike Mustard. This is, this mustard is discard pile. Rapid Strike is discard pile. So that has like the Blastoise kind of effect. Oh wow, I don't have Single Strike yet. At least not in that set. Maybe they were in the first half of the box. Phoebe, Sword and Shieldert. Urn of Vitality. That level ball is a good grab. Phoebe, single strike scroll, single strike energy, level ball. Nope, I've only gotten rapid strike mustard so far.
A mirror breaker for Restrazard? Metal energy. That's epic. Wow, why do I have um, this uncommon gold bat over there? Pachirisu! I think that's our first Pachirisu, actually, out of the box. Mean Fu, a ball toy. Golarian, Mr. Mime. Bruxish. Sap Sipper Bufalot, Urn of Vitality, Steaming Mad, that Primate, and oh, look at that! Beautiful single strike alt art. We got the single strike alt art. I was not expecting anything else big from this set, but look at the single strikes coming through for us. This is such a cool artwork, too. Like, super cool. Single strike gets from deck? That's so broken. I mean, yes, they are both re re uh, resources. That's a cool card. That's a really cool card. I'm surprised I haven't pulled any single strike mustards either. Does that, I mean, which mustard is more sought after right now? Is it the single or the rapid? Oh, you know what? Let me go ahead and give away this code. Because I got a hot pool. That's why. One, two, three. Energy. You haven't seen it either? I believe it. Yeah, they're not as easy to dwindle down your hand with item cards like we used to. It's amazing that, like, how much Ultra Ball not being in the format, like, really throws things. throws a wrench in things like that. There he is. You know the place card is the last card in your hand. Search your deck for a single strike Pokemon and put it onto your bench. Yeah, that is that's way better, I feel. This is more useful early game. Rapid strike's more useful late game. I'm trying to think if there's an easy way to dwindle down your hand though. Maybe with like Dusk Noir or something. Not Dusk Noir, Dusk Dusk Clock? No. Dusk all. <laughs> I was like, why am I like way off on the uh, evolution chain there. Call for family, Drampa, and a Marowak. Yeah, the, 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 you can discard three. Also, Perserker, not bad for that either. Perserker, not Perserker, but Galarian Meow can discard two to look for a Perserker. But then you have to play a bench person that just does nothing for you other than makes that that uh combo happen houndor shinx galiger spoink bronzor Firo, grumpig that's how i keep getting uncommons in the common slots scorn of score or scroll of scorned said that backwards we got a center scorch and stoutland stoutland I, I, I always, I remember the episode for Statland so vividly because it's like they totally pull a Mufasa moment and I just laugh and laugh and laugh, right? How good is this Statland compared to the Shock Locker? Whoa, I mean, I like Double Dip Fangs. Powerful energy with it, maybe? Not bad, not bad. We got Stoutland. Stoutland. Not as good, sadly. I mean, anytime it's a basic over uh, at stage two, it's usually not as good. That's just how games are supposed to work, to be honest. Nope, I cannot super. You can use uh, exclamation point codes and buy them with a discount. But, uh, I mean, if you've not been here to get the codes I've given out already, like, it's, it's... I, I don't tend to give out codes when people ask for them. I think you guys need to go figure out how to buy them, just like I did when I started out. Single Strike Energy and a gold, uh, how gold? Hollow Embor. Nice, nice. That's our, uh, one, two, three, four, five, sixth hollow. How many packs left? That's a good question, Smash. There's five packs left. Five packs left. What do you think we still have in here? We've gotten some pretty good high ends. Some pretty good high ends here with Coco, Corviknight, 
uh, Alt Art or uh, Single Strike Urshifu V and the Rainbow Single Strike Urshifu V Max. Pretty pretty good high end. Pretty good high end. You predict two hits, Smash. Okay, okay. I know rainbows are nice. Rainbows are nice. That's what they're there for. One, two, three. Energy. I'm um, okay. I've, I've been having a little bit of bad luck in life, but I, I can't say I've been having bad luck in cards. So it's, you know, if it's one or the other, I mean, which one are you going to choose, right? <laughs> we got Indeedy, Vivi, Carnivine, Rapid Strike Mustard, and a Claydol. <laughs> I know that's that's actually it's funny because like everybody in the world be like you choose good luck in life <laughs> Col card collectors uh, I don't know <laughs> I may choose good luck in cards and bad luck in life <laughs> right yeah that's the thing hi mean food silly cobra Galarian Mr. Mind Bell Sprout Onyx Rapid Strike Energy, a Phoebe, Heat More, Heat Less, Single Strike Mawile, and an Aegis Slash. Fancy cardboards all day long, yeah. <laughs> ah, this code's giving me issue. I'll give it away. <laughs> you guys can have this difficult code, um, cause it's not. It doesn't like me. <laughs> <laughs> I keep feeling like I'm seeing like a slight discoloration here. Doesn't it look like a faded card for the last one? You gotta love uh, Pokemon print quality, right? Pokemon print quality. Hey, Pachirisu, Chimeco, Hone Edge, Horsey, Mankey, Tool Jammer, Golbat, Gliscor, Gliscor, sorry, Carcoal. And a Lorantis. Uh oh. You said two more hits and we've got none, Smash. I'm worried. I am worried. I think we. I swear, I swear we need at least like one more to make it like fair. Fair box value. Last two packs, always, right? Last last packs, magic. As in plural packs. Remoraid. I love this Remoraid too. It's so really silly. Did you, do you guys see the detail on this? The um, if I if I hold it in the right spot, not the wrong spot. There we go. He's squirting up water and holding a rock, a stick, and two more rocks. I don't know how he got it balanced in the first place, but that's pretty impressive for the Remoraid. More Pico, it's hangry. Now I have one of these up here, and I have two more now, so maybe I just randomly build a more Pico deck. Dewblade, Cheryl, Mankey. And hey, it's a hit, Tyranitar V. Tito, learning from Octillery, yeah, for sure. Last pack is it's magic. Could it to be the magic? Looks like I average about like a little over a minute per pack. That's why my pack days were always so long. They were like two minutes long, and half of it was introduction. <laughs> Don't let you be wrong. It's a T-Tar pack. Do t does T-Tar like you? If T-Tar likes you, it should be a good pack. If T-Tar doesn't like you, I'm sorry for your loss. <laughs> Mawile, Cherubi, Luxio, Durant, Perugly, Bellsprout, and... Oh, it's a... No, that's not a bad hit. That's not a bad hit for me. I can play Mr. Rhyme. <laughs> I can play the ball guy. <laughs> three is all you need to, to build that deck. I, I have three rhymes. I can build the deck now. <laughs> There's no IRL events. I'm playing rhyme. I'm playing rhyme. <laughs> Not bad. Um, I mean, not not was I not what I was expecting out of my box today, but uh, not bad, I would say. Um, <clears throat> I think it's stuff I don't have, to be honest. 
<clears throat> I don't think I had enough Cocos to play Coco. Corviknight, I think I was looking to find one more, so we hit that box. Um, into the T-Tar ring. <clears throat> uh, let's do Hollows first. So out of the booster box, we got one, two, three, four, five, six hollows. <clears throat> Not terrible. I do think we got quite a few reverse rares, like Glared Mr. Rhyme here. We did get a reverse rare Cinescorch, Drampa, Primate, Imbor, Marowak. Um, oh wow, that was back to back. The sharp. Ponyard. Interesting. Octillery. That's a great one. Um, reverse. Rare. Lorantis. Charon. Aegislash. Sandaconda. Oh, we got one Sandaconda and Houndoom. So that's a lot of reverse rares that are, like, playable. Four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11. Like, that was 11 out of 36 packs is... At least a third of them were, like, hollow rares, you know? It's nice to have, like, a 2 Houndoom Doom Sim That means I can play either way, to be honest. And Ball Guy. Can't forget about Ball Guy. And, I mean, 5 is kind of light. But I can't complain because of what the sixth slot was. Titar, Rapid Strike, Urshifu V, and Pole Envy, and the, very all over the place. Very all over the place. I'm not sure what you can do with any of these singly. I mean, I think maybe the Stoutland's a, a tech. Maybe you play one Titar. Was hoping for the Alt Art Titar, but I think we'll manage. We got two V Maxes, Coco and Corviknight. Both very pretty. And Alt Art Urshifu V. So that was where our sixth slot was. And we got the Rainbow uh, V Max, which is cool as well. And that is the booster box. Now we're going to take a short break um, and talk to some people for a minute. Um, but for YouTube, thank you guys so much for stopping by. Um, this has been fun. We'll be trying to get out another video soon. I believe I'll be trying to post videos more consistently, like either Thursdays or Fridays in the afternoon so that we always have something every week. Um, I know for Digimon, I've been starting to do Digi Mondays on the Game Capital Discord. Um, if you guys want a link to that, just let me know. You guys can contact me on Discord or something else and we can start playing Digimon because I've been enjoying that. I'm not sure if I'll start streaming that or anytime soon, but it is definitely a possibility, especially since I've been enjoying that game a lot. Um, thank you guys so much, and I'll see you guys next time. Aloha.